Hey, what's up? This is Pat Leach. Let's take a look at some cryptocurrency exchange platforms where we trade coins and tokens for someone else's, or we could sell back into fiat. Fiat currencies are government issued notes that are originally loaned from banks with interest, creating an ever growing debt and a lot of it. It's a failing system and blockchain technology is proving to be a fantastic alternative. There's a few types of exchanges, so the platform you choose will depend entirely on your motive. For example, some centralized exchanges like Coinbase, CoinSpot, and Bitfinex offer the option to link a bank account and debit card through a verification process that allows us to purchase cryptos with fiat. Once you've linked your bank account, you can move in and out of the crypto space as often as you'd like, but pay attention to the exchange fees because it's not free. There are other centralized exchanges like Bittrex, Binance, and Poloniex. They host many coins and tokens, but don't offer the option to link a bank account. It's just crypto. Creating an account with these exchanges essentially gives you an online wallet that holds whatever coins and tokens the exchange offers. But keep in mind that whoever owns the private keys owns the crypto. And these centralized exchanges do not release the private keys to their clients. Instead, offer the platform where crypto savages like us can deposit, trade, and withdraw under their stipulations, which are usually affordable trading fees and varying withdrawal limitations. There are agreements implemented protecting the exchanges in case of a devastating hack, leaving everyone broke. They've got to cover their ass because exchanges can get hacked and are the least safe place to keep your crypto. They are called exchanges for a reason. After you exchange your coins and tokens for new holdings, send them to your hardware wallet immediately. Protect yourself. These centralized exchanges do offer an additional security measure called two-factor authentication, which requires the Google Authenticator app. It's a free download from either the Apple app or Google Play Store that allows you to scan a QR code within the security settings of the particular exchange to generate its specific six-digit code that resets every 30 seconds. If you choose to enable this feature, you will be required to enter the six-digit code after logging in with your email and password. Use this, because more security is always better. And then there are decentralized exchanges like BitShares and EtherDelta that are simply open source software programs designed to enable cryptocurrency trading without governance. Absolutely no fiat currencies involved here. These scripts have been launched and exist for us to participate in or not. The private keys are generated for the account's creator and there is no need for verification, as everyone is treated like an Android. No ID required, send and receive as much as you want. But hey, the easiest way to lose money in this game is to straight up give it away. Never send crypto to an exchange without a plan.